In the heart of every winter, a seed of hope is sown, a celebration of unity, purpose, and collective strength. This seed, my dear listeners, is Kwanzaa. Born in the crucible of the civil rights movement in the United States, the origins of Kwanzaa trace back to 1966. This holiday was not derived from centuries-old traditions or religious doctrines, but was a conscious creation of Dr. Molana Karenga, a prominent figure in the Black Power movement. Dr. Karenga was deeply moved and troubled by the Watts riots, a series of violent clashes that unfolded over six days in the predominantly black neighborhood of Watts in Los Angeles. In response to this social upheaval, he sought to create a celebration that would reconnect African Americans with their African heritage, while also fostering a sense of community and collective strength. Thus, the concept of Kwanzaa was born, a week-long celebration running from December 26 to January 1st. The name Kwanzaa derives from the Swahili phrase Matunda Ya Kwanzaa, meaning first fruits, a nod to harvest festivals celebrated in various parts of Africa. At the heart of Kwanzaa are the Nguzo Saba, or the Seven Principles. These principles, each celebrated on a separate day of Kwanzaa, are Umoja, unity, Kujichagulia, self-determination, Ujima, collective work and responsibility, Ujamaa, cooperative economics, Nia, purpose, Kumba, creativity, and Imani, faith. Each principle serves as a guide for personal and communal development and a means to celebrate African heritage. Through these principles, Kwanzaa encourages the African-American community to honor their history, to stand together, and to forge ahead with a shared sense of purpose. It is a time for reflection, for joy, and for renewed commitment to collective growth and progress. A celebration born out of turmoil, Kwanzaa was a beacon of unity and strength for the African-American community. From the ashes of the Watts riots, Kwanzaa emerged as a symbol of resilience, a testament to the enduring spirit of a community and a celebration of African heritage and unity. At the core of Kwanzaa are seven principles as solid as the pillars of the earth, guiding the celebration and the community. First, we have Umoja, which means unity. This principle is a call to strive for and maintain unity in the family, community, nation, and race. It's about understanding that we are all interconnected and our actions affect one another. It's a principle that fosters a sense of belonging and solidarity. Next is Kujichagulia, or self-determination. This principle encourages us to define ourselves, name ourselves, create for ourselves, and speak for ourselves. It's about owning our identity, our narrative, and our destiny. It's a powerful affirmation of one's self-worth and potential. The third principle is Ujima, translating to collective work and responsibility. It urges us to build and maintain our community together and make our brothers and sisters' problems our problems and to solve them together. It's about shared effort, shared responsibility and shared triumph. The fourth principle is Ujamaa, or cooperative economics. This principle calls for us to build and maintain our own stores, shops and other businesses and to profit from them together. It's about economic self-sufficiency and shared prosperity. Fifth is Nia, meaning purpose. This principle encourages us to make our collective vocation the building and developing of our community in order to restore our people to their traditional greatness. It's about having a collective meaningful goal and working towards it. The sixth principle is Kumba, or creativity. This principle asks us to do always as much as we can in the way we can in order to leave our community more beautiful and beneficial than we inherited it. It's about using our creative abilities for the betterment of our community. Finally, we have Imani, meaning faith. This principle teaches us to believe with all our heart in our people, our parents, our teachers, our leaders, and the righteousness and victory of our struggle. It's about hope, trust, and the power of belief. These principles not only shape the Kwanzaa celebration, but also guide the community towards unity, purpose, and collective strength. Like a river that adapts its course over time, Kwanzaa too has evolved, reaching shores far and wide. Just as rivers carve new paths, 
reshaping landscapes, so too has Kwanzaa reshaped the cultural landscape since its inception in 1966. Born from the heart and soul of the African-American community, Kwanzaa was initially an intimate celebration, a beacon of unity, identity and purpose. But as the years passed, the festival's radiance grew, extending its reach beyond its original borders. Today, it's not just an African-American tradition, but a global celebration observed by millions around the world, transcending racial, geographical and cultural boundaries. Kwanzaa's influence is not merely confined to the seven days of celebration. It has profoundly impacted African-American culture, reinforcing the ties to African heritage. The festival's seven principles, or Nguzo Saba, have become a guiding beacon, not just during the festival, but throughout the year. These principles have fostered a sense of community, self-determination and collective responsibility, shaping the cultural identity of African Americans. But Kwanzaa's influence doesn't stop there. Its recognition by mainstream society symbolizes a broader acceptance and appreciation of African heritage. Schools, institutions and communities across the United States and beyond now acknowledge Kwanzaa, incorporating its principles into their cultural curricula. The festival's symbols, such as the Kinara, have become familiar sites, not just in African-American homes, but in diverse spaces around the globe. Moreover, Kwanzaa has inspired other communities to explore and celebrate their own cultural roots, fostering a global dialogue of cultural exchange and mutual respect. It's a testament to Kwanzaa's universal appeal that it has become a platform for promoting unity and understanding among diverse cultures. And so, Kwanzaa continues to evolve, its influence rippling outwards, reaching new shores, touching new hearts. It serves as a reminder that traditions are not stagnant, but dynamic, ever-changing, reflecting the fluidity of human experience. From a spark ignited in the heart of Los Angeles, Kwanzaa has become a global flame, illuminating the richness of African heritage. From its humble beginnings, Kwanzaa has grown into a beacon of cultural pride and unity, a testament to the enduring strength and resilience of the human spirit. As we stand in the present, Kwanzaa continues to be a vibrant tapestry of culture, unity and heritage. This rich celebration rooted deeply in African traditions, is alive and flourishing in communities around the globe today. Let's dive into the heart of this festival, where you'll find a cornucopia of rituals and traditions. Central to Kwanzaa is the Kinara, a candle holder that cradles seven candles, each representing one of the seven principles of Kwanzaa. These principles, or Nguzo Saba, are Umoja, Unity, Kujichagulia, Self-Determination, Ujima, collective work and responsibility, Ujamaa, cooperative economics, Nia, purpose, Kumba, creativity, and Imani, faith. As the week progresses, each night a candle is lit, illuminating the principle of the day. This ritual is a beacon of unity, a reminder of the collective strength and purpose that binds us together. Then we come to Karamu, the feast, traditionally held on December 31st. This is no ordinary meal, mind you. The Feast of Kwanzaa is a gastronomic journey that brings families and communities together, serving up a delicious spread of traditional African dishes. Each bite is a celebration of culture, a testament to the resilience and vibrancy of the African diaspora. Gifts, or zawadi, are also a part of the Kwanzaa tradition, but these are not just any gifts. They're often handmade, symbolizing the value of creativity and labor. These gifts are not just about the joy of receiving, but also about the satisfaction of giving, the pleasure of creating, and the importance of sharing. Each of these traditions, from the lighting of the Kinara to the sharing of Zawadi, is more than just a ritual. They are a living, breathing testament to the richness of African heritage, a vibrant celebration of unity, and a powerful reminder of the strength that comes from collective purpose. In the heart of winter, the flame of Kwanzaa burns bright, reminding us of our collective strength, unity and purpose. As we look towards the future, the legacy of Kwanzaa continues to inspire and guide us. Kwanzaa, a celebration steeped in heritage and rich with cultural significance, has left an indelible mark on the world. Its legacy, however, is not just in the seven days of celebration, 
but in the lessons it imparts, the unity it fosters, and the sense of identity it cultivates. Kwanzaa's influence extends beyond the African-American community and touches the hearts of people worldwide. It is more than just a holiday. It is a beacon of cultural appreciation, a testament to the strength of community and a celebration of African roots that have spread across the globe. The legacy of Kwanzaa is inextricably linked with the celebration of heritage. It serves as a potent reminder of the importance of understanding our past, celebrating our roots and honoring our ancestors. It emphasizes the power of knowledge, the significance of heritage and the value of unity. In this way, Kwanzaa continues to inspire us to reflect on our history, cherish our traditions and embrace our identity. Moreover, Kwanzaa's legacy is etched in the hearts of those it inspires. It encourages us to live by the seven principles, to support each other, and to strive for collective success. It teaches us about cooperation, purpose, and creativity. It inspires us to build and maintain our community, to solve problems together, and to believe in our shared future. Through Kwanzaa, we are reminded of the strength that comes from unity, the purpose that stems from a shared history, and the collective power that is born from working together. It is a celebration that illuminates the path towards a future where cultural heritage is honored, unity is cherished, and community is the bedrock of society. In the seeds of Kwanzaa, the future finds its roots, growing towards a tomorrow filled with unity, purpose, and collective strength. Kwanzaa, with its enduring legacy, continues to inspire us, guiding us towards a future that is rich with cultural appreciation, community strength and shared prosperity. Happy Kwanzaa, everyone. Ooh, 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 ooh.